Welcome to this channel. In this video, I will help you to be able to reinstate your disabled uh, advertising account. If it is an ad account or business manager mm -hmm. or user account, if you follow this procedure, you'll be able to get a reinstatement. So first of all, for those who don't know how to get to the account quality, like where I am, or uh, to the ad manager, where they can see the restriction, like what I am just seeing on my screen, you log into your account by going to facebook.com. Then after that, you look at the left hand corner you see the ad manager if you don't see it you will see see more then when you click on the see more the ad manager will come then you click on it so for example when you click on the ad manager it will open so when it opens you just see something like this one so when it opens so for example um i am told you can use this business account to advertise select see details um to learn why and what you can do to resolve this issue. So that is exactly um, what they are saying. You click on see details, okay? So when you click on see details, it will take you to the details of the restriction. So this one, um, they are saying request review. Your business account is restricted from advertising. So when you click on, the, it says, this business is not allowed to advertise. This is because the business didn't comply with one or more of our advertising um, policies affecting business assets or other standards. Learn more about this. So um, we just click on request review. But before you request review, um, let me just let you know this. The restrictions are of different types. For some of them, before you request review, they will ask you to identify to, to confirm your identity. So in case you are being asked to confirm your identity, you will have to make sure that you change your first and last name. So how do you do that? I, I mean, if your first and last name is not matching with what is on your ID card, and the ID card you can use is uh, your national ID, your passport, your voter ID, or your driving license. You click on your profile picture, go to settings and privacy. From there, you go to settings, and then you check um, your personal details. You click on the personal details. You look at the name. So under the name, you check your first name and your last name. If your first name and your last name doesn't match exactly with your real details, you make sure you change them, OK? Then after you change that one, you also go to personal details. Check, check your date of birth. If your date of birth doesn't match with your real date of birth, uh, you just have to make sure that you change it to match with the correct one. You make those changes and then also come back and check on your gender. Make sure the gender is the same as the gender on your, let me just go back to Facebook home and show you. Okay, so when you come back to Facebook home, you click on the your left, go to your about section, Go to contact and basic info. Check on your gender. After you, if you have here too, you can also change the birth date. But if the birth date is already okay, no problem. And so you check on your gender. So when the gender and everything is the same, you just come back here. And then if everything is the same, if, if as I said, if they are asking you to request review, you make sure that you make those changes. In some cases, they will even ask you to upload your own picture, your face, before they ask you to upload the ID card. So you upload all that. After that, they will ask you to request the review. So in requesting the review, they will ask you the reason why you are requesting the review. So you have to write something like what I have just added here. So let me tell you what I have written. So something like, yeah, Facebook, my business account has been restricted from advertising. Uh, and this has affected my business greatly. I am told this account, its ads, and some of its advertising assets are disabled because it doesn't comply with our policy, our policy on advertising, or oh, it should be our advertising policies. With our advertising policies affecting business assets, such as having too many ads rejected, attempting to circumvent our ad review process, participating in a fraudulent behavior or associated with owners where they account. I've stated all Facebook policies in detail as stipulated at, and I put the website where you can um, check the, 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 
policies of Facebook. I'm just indicating that for them to know that I've gone through all their policies. And I am extra sure I didn't violate any policy or community guidelines. But please forgive me if I mistakenly violated any policy without knowing. Please help me get my business account, my business manager account reinstated. Then you send. So when you click on submit, like this case is not going, but I'm sure um, probably there's another problem. But when you click on submit, it's supposed to go. So when it goes, and most of the time, when you check within 48 hours, you'll be able to get the account reinstated. So after you submit, you come back to the business home and then you'll be checking here. Normally, it will indicate that um, your account will be, when you click on the accounts, um, you go to business manager, very good. We can even request the review from here. Start process. Let's confirm it is you. Very good. Very good. So we can just continue the process from here. Okay, so this is what happened. They first have to confirm your ID card, uh, what do you call it, your phone number and your email address. So they ask to confirm the email address. So you put your email address and they will send a code to your email for you to confirm. Then after that, they will ask for you to confirm your um your your what we call it your phone number then you also put your phone number they will send a code to your phone number then you put a code there and confirm after that they may ask you to confirm um your picture your image so that is what they are asking here so when you put your picture you click on continue okay so this one in addition they are asking for the ID card. So for example, the name was not exactly matching. So once they're asking for the ID, I have to make sure the name, the order. In fact, the name was my, was correct, but the order in which the arrangements were. So I have to review that and then confirm it. Then after that, I have to also look at the birth date and confirm that everything is matching the way it's supposed to be. So the birth date is correct. I will just proceed to upload the ID card. So as I have uploaded the ID, so you click on continue to say, thank you for completing the identity confirmation process. It will take us some minute. So you see something like review requested and it said on September 1st, 2023, we are always looking for the security of our community. So while we are reviewing your information, you won't be able to advertise. So we just have to wait for some time. So mostly it takes so from some five to um 30 minutes, but in some cases it can take up to 48 hours. Okay, can take up to 48 hours. So we just check, wait for some few minutes and see if it will be approved. It is about five minutes now. And I want to refresh and we see whether it is reinstated or it's not reinstated. So when I refresh it, boom, as you can see, it's reinstated. It said advertising access reinstated. Thank you for confirming your identity. This business can now advertise. It's ads, ad account and other affected advertising assets will return to their previous state. In some cases, they will even go ahead and apologize for the inconvenience they have created. The advertising restriction has been removed and we can advertise again. Um, so if you follow this procedure and you make your appeal and your account is not reinstated, please don't worry. Just leave your comments in the comment section. Okay, leave your comments in the comment section. Um, you can also contact us and by following the WhatsApp link in the description, I will be able to help you get your um, advertising access reinstated. We also run ad campaigns and not just any ad campaign, effective ad campaigns that will help you to make sales, to make more money and to be able to, you know, um, get value for whatever you are spending. If you need our help, please don't hesitate to leave your comments in the comment section or follow the WhatsApp link to WhatsApp us 
or check our website link to check more info we have on our website. Thank you once again and see you in the next video. Please, lastly, remember to subscribe and turn on the notification bell because I know most of you haven't uh, subscribed up to this bar. So please, if you haven't subscribed, subscribe now and turn on the notification bell. Bye-bye.